boys and girls, it's Mrs Mackenzie here from Primary 1 and I'd just like to read you a story, one of my favourites, called Super Tato by Sue Hendry and I've brought Super Tato with me for you. She's going to listen to it as well. Okay. Some vegetables are frozen for a very good reason. Don't believe me? Then keep reading. It was night time in the supermarket and all was quiet. Crash, bang, something had escaped from the freezer, something small and brown and green, something looking for trouble, big trouble. <gasps> help, help, cried Carrot, I'm stuck to the conveyor belt. Ah, cried Broccoli, someone's drawn on my face. Humph, cried Cucumber. Who was doing this? And was there anyone who could help these vegetables in distress? Super Tato to the rescue! He used his super speed. He used his super strength. He used a flannel and some soapy water. I know who's behind this, said Super Tato. There's a pea on the loose. Oh no, not a pea! Everyone gasped. Yes, a pea, but I'm out of the freezer now, and I'm never going back. Ha 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 ha! And the evil pea ran off to commit more terrible crimes. Time for a dip, little veggies. That's enough, shouted the potato. He leapt toward the pea, but the pea popped out of his hand and vanished into thin air. Super Tato set out on a super search. He crept through the cakes, <gasps> checked the cheese, snuck up on the vegetables, then something caught his eye. <gasps> the game's up, yelled Super Tato. <gasps> but the pea bounced out of reach and onto a trolley. Super Tato was just about to stop him with his super strength when the trolley crashed and he was thrown down into the icy depths of the freezer. Was this the end for Super Tato? Gasp! Not quite, but the pea was off his trolley and lying in wait. You're finished, Super Tato, he shrieked, but Super Tato summoned all his strength and ran for it. The pea nearly had him at the beans, closed in on him at the cheese. He had him cornered at the cakes. So much for super potato, screeched the pea. You're about to be mashed potato. Surely this was the end for super potato. Not today, my friend, said super potato. Gotcha. Hmm, said the pea. Oh yes, said Super Tato. I set my trap and you fell for it. Or should that be in it? And he grinned a super grin. Super Tato had saved the day. Take him away, he said, and the pea was marched back to the freezer where he belonged. This daily taste of pea, said Broccoli, and everybody laughed and cheered. So remember, folks, some vegetables are frozen for a very good reason. Maybe you'd better go and check your freezer, just in case there's an escapee in your home. This end. Can't wait to see you all in primary one, boys and girls. Take care. Bye.